So here we are at Century Park, the southernmost tip of the LRT line, thanks to the extension. Now the extension enables Edmontonians like you to travel throughout our vibrant city with a lot more convenience. Now you can travel to a number of different, for example, creative destinations that are in and around the Arts District. Speaking of the Arts District, did you know that Edmonton Transit has collaborated with a number of different partners to showcase the world-class talent and great entertainment that's literally just a 20-minute LRT ride away? Tell you what, bring the family, hop on board, and let's discover together how convenient it is to make ETS the everyday way to your creative destination. Our creative destination is Edmonton Opera. Edmonton Opera is a resident company at the Jubilee Auditorium. We are a producing company, which means that we don't bring in touring or traveling shows, but we actually put all the elements together here in Edmonton. So the sets, the costumes, the crew, the talent, are all local people. Opera is bigger than life, uh, but lets you look at your own life, and the singers always are able to convey their art and convey the emotion of the art and of the story. Edmonton Opera is world class, but it is affordable and it's a full night's entertainment. Our creative destination is the Edmonton Public Library. The Stanley A. Milner Library is the heart of Edmonton's downtown and is in the heart of the Arts District. This is our largest location for the Edmonton Public Library and we have all manner of resources and entertainment available for you. You can come to the Stanley A. Milner Library and enjoy a film series, learn how to paint, work with a professional writer, you can enjoy a puppet show, read a magazine or a newspaper in a language other than English. We have the gallery at Milner where we feature works from emerging Edmonton artists. You can do all kinds of things while you're here and all of our programs are free. My creative destination is the Citadel Theatre. The Citadel Theatre is Canada's largest regional not-for-profit, and that's what surprises a lot of people, because we have this huge building. We have five theatres under one roof, which is the only one of its kind like that in the entire country. It's a cool place to come to because there's something for everyone here. At the Citadel Theatre, we're very proud of the high-caliber, award-winning, audience-favorite productions that we've been programming for many, many years. And we plan to produce theatre of this caliber for many, many years to come. Our creative destination is the Francis Winspear Center for Music. Not only is it the performance home of the Edmonton Symphony Orchestra, it was created to be the absolute perfect space for a live performance of pretty much anything. The hall was built so that any music played on our stage would sound as good as it possibly could, not only in the first row, but way up in the back as well. We probably have about 600 events taking place in this hall every year. We have had 80 performances a year of the Edmonton Symphony Orchestra that happen here. We are a community asset. Our creative destination is the Art Gallery of Alberta. The Art Gallery of Alberta is a fantastic facility dedicated to visual culture. We view ourselves as a provincial institution with a, an Edmonton heart. We've been open for six months. We've had 100,000 visitors since that time. We have an ambitious program of both historical and contemporary work. We have a children's gallery, which is specifically uh, an interpretive set site for young kids. This is a very remarkable place. Make your next stop the Art Gallery of Alberta. Our creative destination is the Edmonton International Film Festival. The Edmonton International Film Festival is an annual nine-day celebration of films from around the world. We like to think of it as independent, international, and eye-opening. We really do scour the world to try and find really interesting feature films and short films. But what we do is we also try and bring in as many of the filmmakers as we can. Our audience members love the fact that they can watch a film when they know the person who made it is sitting in the same auditorium as you might be sitting in. Filmmakers are taking a chance with us as well and they always walk away saying Edmonton is really the unknown cinematic gem in all of Canada. We have partnered in creating the 
art and design in public places uh, portfolio in the downtown. And during the summer, I have university students who take people on free walking tours of all of those installations. Or you can just come down and take a, a historical tour. Boy, we just have all kinds of things for you to see in the core as far as creative destinations. Downtown Edmonton has a very unique arts district. I don't know of any other city in Canada where you have a world-class art gallery, a world-class concert hall, and a world-class theater all next door to each other in one block on a, on a central square. You get off an LRT uh, train in Churchill Square, you come up the stairs, you actually come up into these venues if that's what you want to do. But that's not the only way to get in downtown Edmonton. We have express buses coming in from the west and the south. You can get on a bus and be downtown in no time at all without going through a whole bunch of stops. More and more people are starting to realize that this is the way to access downtown. The easy access to the Stanley A. Milner Library is a great thing for Edmontonians. An escalator ride up from the Churchill Station. We are thrilled to be that accessible. You can leave your car someplace where you don't have to fight the traffic and you don't have to fight getting another parking spot. If you're planning to buy tickets ahead of time, please also consider taking the LRT as part of those plans. You, living way out in the suburbs, can hop onto the LRT and you can be 18, 20 minutes away to downtown Edmonton. All of the stuff that defines the fabric, the cultural fabric of Edmonton, has found a home and it's great to know that you can get here so easily using public transportation. So I encourage you to take ETS. Take ETS. Take ETS. And join us at this great creative destination, the Citadel Theatre. The Edmonton Opera. The Art Gallery of Alberta. The Edmonton Public Library. The Windspear Centre. The Edmonton International Film Festival. Come downtown and see this stuff.